all right guys um it's golden boy i'm back for a real quick video um this is a how-to video pretty much on how to make this stand here um the measurements i'm going to give you is only for two guns is it just for the stand for two guns only because that's what i had so i can give you the accurate measurements for that and it literally come out looking just like this if you follow the instructions um so all right guys here's just a quick pick of everything laid out um as you can see we have um some uh pvc cement glue a small hand saw measuring tape of course you need a marker to mark everything off we have uh seven uh 90 degree angle elbows four freeway um tubes one four-way tube um it should be four it should be six pre-cut four and a quarter tubes um three five inch tubes three eight inch cut tubes and three 16 inch cut tubes now they should be um one inch pvc okay now let's just get into the video here really quick now you're gonna need the best thing to do is go to home depot and get yourself the 10 foot long one inch pvc pipe which is what i did that was enough to make this stand um so what we have is uh really quick for the measurements you're gonna cut six pieces of four and a quarter inches and those six pieces are gonna be one two three four five and six so that's gonna those four those six pieces are gonna be cut four and a quarter inches all right and then you're gonna need three five inch pieces and those three five inch pieces are going to be these three right here one two three so you're going to cut three five inch pieces from that 10 foot pvc piping then after that you're going to need three eight inch pieces so you're going to cut three eight inch pieces which is one two and three now you don't have to be exact perfectly because it looks pretty much perfect but it doesn't have to be it's gonna be kind of hard to cut it I'll tell you what to get to cut it if you don't have anything and after you get the three eight inch cut which will be these three right here are the eight inch this is where they will go you're going to cut three 16 inch pieces off of that 10 foot piping and the 16 inch pieces are going to be these three one two and three so total from that um that that 10 foot one inch pvc pipe you're gonna get uh 13 pieces cut out total which is the six four and a quarter inch which is one two three four five six for three five inch which is one two three the three eight inch one, two, three, and a three sixteen inch, which is going to be the back, which is one, two, and three. Then you are going to need, oh, let me see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven 90 degree angled elbows, which is for, make sure it's for the one inch PVC piping. So you're gonna need seven of those, which is one, two, three, four, five six seven that's where they go and then you're going to need four t one inch t um the angled ones well they're not angled but they're the t's so you're gonna need the the one inch pvc piping of the t's which is one two three and the four so that's where they go and then you're going to need, what else are you going to need? One of these guys right here, which it has the, four, the it's, it's also one inch. Make sure you get everything is one inch. And it's the four way, one, two, three, four. Okay? So after you do that, um, just make sure you put it together. Um, make sure everything fits nice and snug um, 
You're also going to get the uh, PVC cement, which is a small little can. Um, I'll show you that in the picture. Um, now what I didn't do was uh, I glued every single, every single, let me see, elbow in except for every joint in except for these right here. So I could take it apart and it'll be nice and flat. But uh, you don't really need to see that. Um, also you're going to get the, the insulation, the foam insulation from Home Depot. Which you just, once you're done painting it, you could just rip the plastic off and it'll glue it right on. Now what I used to paint this black was um, the Plasti Dip. You can get that from the paint department. Um, I like the Plasti Dip because it, I, I felt like it would be more durable. Um, if you had to repaint it or if there was a scratch, you could just peel it right off and paint it right back. And like I said, I threw some stickers on there. Um, but let me just show you. This is what it should look like. Um, there's enough space for your hoppers and your tanks. Uh, you shouldn't have any issues whatsoever. There goes my stand. Um, hope you guys like it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, if it wasn't clear enough for you, just uh, leave any questions in the comment section below. And um, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I'll just show you what it looks like from the back.